Apa kabar semuanya? It's me, Leslie, here in sunny Indonesia. I am making this video today because I have finished another one of my books and I would truly like to read it to you all. Thank you so much for your kind attention. Let's begin. This book is called The Bridge Made of Sand. I've been building a bridge made of sand. Mom and Dad say, I can't do that. I say, I can, and I am. It's hard work, though, getting the water, getting the sand, getting the determination, mixing them all together. Little by little, every day, I tell myself I can and I am. I believe in me. Mom and Dad watch my progress from afar. They're worried that I might fail but I know how to pick myself up, dust myself off, and start again. It has been months now, and my bridge is almost done. Where will it end, they all wonder. At the beach, of course, I say. Who is they, they ask. And I say, I'll find out when I'm finished. It's winter now and my bridge is complete. I can and I did. Now let's see who's on the other side of this bridge. The end. Um, I tried some new methods with this book. Uh, I'm actually very pleased with the way it turned out. I used pastel and pen, um, and I tried a different style of drawing. I wanted it to be, uh, the book to be filled with uh, bright colors and um, different types of expressive versions of uh, people. Um, so that's what I was doing here, um, working with a different type of uh, drawing style. Uh, I'm doing a lot of experimenting with these new um, books that I've been making. I had a dream about, uh, I don't really know how long ago, maybe three, four months ago, and I had a dream that I was building a bridge made of sand. Um, and my parents were watching me from a distance, but I was determined and I, and I was doing it. But I still don't know where the beach ends. I mean, it ends at the, the, the bridge ends at the beach, but, but who's at the beach waiting for me? I still don't know. Um, and I kind of feel like by making these books, 
I'm building that bridge. And if I keep making these books, the bridge will become complete and I'll get to see what's on the other side. So um, on a personal level, these books are becoming um, my personal journey and they're taking these books are taking me somewhere um, taking me along the journey that I should be going on um, this book is all about determination uh, so believe in yourself is the moral of the story but believe in yourself even if others don't um, I uh, am deciding, I have decided to make uh, children's books that are associated with the self-worth of oneself. Um, my ultimate goal is to uh, speak to young children, uh, like eight and under, something like that, and speak to them through my books and help them learn self-worth through my books. Um, I'm not really sure how much a child learns through reading books, but I'm hoping that the books that I'm creating will assist in the raising, the, in the proper raising of somebody else's child. I only want the best for the future um, generation and um, my goal is to help with the positive progress of our future. Um, my next book, let me show you the cover, my next book is about a, um, a boy. It's called A Boy's Guide to Becoming a Gentleman. I'm super excited about this book. Um, I've already written it. I just haven't illustrated the pages. I would like to assist in boys becoming gentlemen and girls becoming ladies. This book is all about a boy who sees his father as a hero. So um, I am associating being a gentleman with being a hero. Um, his father is his hero, but also his father is a gentleman. And uh, the male's role is so important in the lives of children. Um, a man shows protection. He shows guidance. He, he teaches his son and his daughter uh, the gentle nature of a man. And so uh, that's the direction I'm going in next, A Boy's Guide to Becoming a Gentleman. And it's just to help teach boys how to be more um, courteous to ladies. And uh, it teaches them how to, the book is going to tell them that gentlemen should open doors for ladies, pull out chairs for ladies, but also a gentleman is kind to all creatures. And uh, a gentleman is just what it says, gentle. Um, so I've written a book about that, so I'm looking forward to finishing the illustrations so that I can read it to you all. Um, and my next book after that is going to be uh, for girls about how to be a lady, but I haven't come up with that one yet. Um, since I started off as a girl, uh, I... I feel more inclined to help uh, girls, but I realize as a teacher, I teach girls and boys, so I need to uh, discover how to, um, to to help teach the boys as well, and that's what I'm doing here, and um, it came more easily than I thought it would, uh, but I guess it's because um, we all need some assistance, so, um, anyway, thank you so much for watching this video, um, 
uh, the, these books mean a lot to me, and it actually means a lot to me to, to share um, what I'm doing to help with our future generation, maybe other teachers alike, or um, other uh, or or parents, because uh, perhaps they can take some ideas from these books, and we can all assist in the betterment of our um, future generation. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, until next time, da da.